this and I got fruit snacks and I got an okay, apple sauce, got Takis and I got these little chips and I got cheese it Hello and good morning everyone. Welcome back. We are up. Well, I was gonna say bright and early, but Mindy, this is nothing compared this is to what nothing we're gonna to be doing tomorrow. I'm so worried tomorrow. about tomorrow. <laughs> I feel like I got hit by a truck tomorrow. The same will be boarding our flight right now. How are we going to do I that? Know. <laughs> we did go to bed early, trying to get ahead of the sleep instead yes. of being constantly behind on yes. sleep. The kids are getting ready for school, pour in their cereal. <laughs> Last day of school this week, guys. Tuesday. We're gonna have to do a little bit of catch up when they get back. Is this for you, my boy? Yes, ma'am. Right. Cinnamon toast crunch and then Brexit oil. You having for breakfast to kick things off? Ego. Ego. Lego my ego. Whoa. Isn't that the same? Yeah, that is actually. If someone touched it, you'd be like, Lego my ego. Let go. Yes, yeah, yes, Cruz it. gets it, okay. All right, so that marketing still works. Hazy girl having one of her favorites. This is like a cinnamon crunch Cheerios. As we do prepare to get ready to go out of town from here in this home, some things new and different. This house, as far as getting ready to leave it, leave it secure. We've talked about this yesterday. We do have a lot of things going on at the house while we're gone. So we're gonna have our home builder here walking the contractors through some things. Very excited to see how that changes when we get back. There's some silly things, guys. I don't know if you know this, but I gotta go shovel the snow off of the trampoline. You can't leave the snow on the trampoline while we're gone. So we gotta go shovel the trampoline. How That's kind of funny. Get one. The deer off our trees? I don't know how we're gonna do that, but guess what? They're gonna put up a fence while we're gone, and that might keep them from eating them while we're gone. Not the ones in the front, but the ones in the back. That could possibly help with that, unless they jump the fence. Also today, on the agenda, we're gonna be getting some haircuts, Brexy doodle, freshen up, tighten those sides. Honestly, I just need the haircut too. Buzz this mop of hair I have on I know, I don't head. normally I notice just... that, but on Sunday when Brandon was getting ready for church, I was like, uh, it's time. <laughs> you don't really notice it as much because it's always under a hat. That's true, yeah, it's usually Sunday Sweet when I'm just like, huh, of hair oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Gathering up some carry-on snacks, Advil for the old people. You have to bring all the things, you have to bring the medicine, you have to bring the, you just never know what's gonna happen. You have to bring it all. Otherwise, you're gonna have to run somewhere and spend $15 for a bottle of Tylenol. True. When I just have it, so I might as well bring it. And then Disney is taking care of a lot of the breakfast for us and dinners. There's times that the kids just want a snack, so I just decided to pick some up. We have extra space. We'll eat these while we're gone. <laughs> have an awesome day. Last day of school this week. Woo! It's only a Tuesday. Let's go. Crazy when you get home, we got tumbling. We got haircuts. We got any final packing. Dance. Any tech downloading. We got dance today. Hazy, we won't see you for a while because you're going to go to dance. I love you. Have a great time at dance. That's why your hair looks so cute. And let's see what else, Mom. I got to pack. You got to pack. Yeah, I've got a lot to get We're gonna ready to rock. Also, I We're just want to get the house cleaned up, picked up Yes, today, tidied up so a little bit. Yep, ready. classic. Getting out of town vibe we got going on. Raga, I love you. We're going to freshen up a little bit of that hair. I know. We won't take any length. I know you're going for a thing. Yeah. I'm going to take you, so we'll, we'll be able to have some freedom there. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> okay, buzz is for everyone. Love you guys. We are so dang excited about this trip coming up tomorrow. I do have going through my mind though just how tired we could potentially be, but in the most magical way. I do find when we get Disney exhausted, it's a different kind of exhausted and it's just something that you enjoy. You come back and you crash in bed. Well, everyone else does. I start editing, but you crash in bed fulfilled from so much fun. Tomorrow morning, because we do have an early flight, we've learned to be very early with our family, just a big size family, lots of bags, and all it takes is missing one flight. Years and years ago, we missed one flight because we were only an hour early. They said, sorry, cut off is the 50 minute mark and they didn't let us on the flight and so we have never ever been even close to that since so we usually arrive two hours early with an 8 a.m. flight that is arriving at the airport at 6 a.m. we live almost an hour away from the airport that means leaving the home by like 5 15 a.m. tomorrow at the latest and then have a full day at the park we'll get there arrive in California transported to the Disneyland Resort Hotel check in at the Disney's Grand California and then we will go into the park for the entire day including I don't want to spoil too many of the fun things we have coming up but a one-of-a-kind look at the world of color show in California Adventure after which we will go outside of the park as they close the entire thing down and be let back into the park. So we're talking late, you guys. We're talking very, very late. So getting up crazy early, heading to the park all day, and then staying in the park well after it closes, only to go back to the hotel, exhausted from so much fun, and wake up and do it all over again because the big day is the next day. <laughs> so you guys, we have so much fun coming up, but it also means we need to try and pack in any amount of sleep that we can, any amount of rest that we can, and get things taken care of quickly today so we can get everyone into bed very early tonight. Kids are off at school. Mom and I are gonna do a little tidying up here around the house. Gonna get the vlog edited and uploaded for you guys, we're gonna get ourselves ready to get out of town. I 
I just got home. I just ran some errands. I had some things to take care of. I got those all done. I came home. I still haven't quite put life together yet. Still haven't made the bed, but you guys now know that I'm a bed maker. It's gonna happen today. I thought I'm gonna get the things done that have to be done. Like have to have to be done. One of those is packing. I ended up fitting all three boys into one large suitcase yesterday, which I was actually quite impressed by. Daisy has her own medium sized suitcase to herself. It's funny because this luggage tag is hers. They just kind of go wherever. She has tons of extra room in her suitcase, but I know it's Disney. We'll be bringing stuff home. Here is the battle that I always face. Brandon has bigger clothes, so I feel like he should have the bigger suitcase. I don't ever put things in his suitcase, like all the extras. The kids hair stuff, the medicine, all those extras. So so then I should take the bigger suitcase and I can put all the extras in my suitcase. This is a battle I go through every time. I don't think I'm bringing as much. Maybe I'm bringing like an extra outfit or two. Just like an extra sweater. I just never know what I'm gonna wanna wear. Opinions change as you're there. I'm bringing two pairs of jeans and I might regret that. We're just gonna go with it. After contemplating it and talking it through with you guys, I actually decided I am going to bring the big one because I'm going to pack myself and all the extras. That will leave Brandon with a medium size. I'm really sorry about that, but I will have tons of room for subies. I'm gonna go in and get packed. I set all my stuff up here, which is really awesome. Really, really, really really love this island. I have uh, picked myself up some Disney 100 stuff. Kind of matches hazy. Don't know that I should bring this because it says world. Just don't look there. I did pick up a new sweatshirt today though at Target that's really, really cute. I shared it on our stories. Some other shirts I may be bringing. Lots of stuff going on. Gonna get myself packed, throw it all in this suitcase, and then moving on to the toiletry part of. Hi! Part of this whole situation. Let's get to it. Your island to lay stuff out and I was a little jealous of how cool that was but I have my own cool setup my own island if you will shelf or desk or packing area of sorts and look at this I have got stuff lined up Kids are home from school and things get a little tricky, a little complicated, a few moving parts right now, but we need to still yet take care of haircuts today. We've got these boys going to tumbling right now, so I'm gonna run there to tumbling. But also, guys, we gotta pack our carry-on snack bags. Mom has got that loaded up right here. In fact, she pulled the drawers out just to make sure we remember the Ziplocs right there to load up our snack bags for carry-on snacks, airport delights, all of the above. I mean, it's fun. This is fun. Of us, I mean, maybe a granola bar will really be sufficient for tomorrow morning. I mean, honestly, it's, it's such a short really. flight, but this is going to be fun to load all these snack bags, but mom, what do you want us to do first? Do you want us to tumbling haircuts and come back and do snack bags yes. or do snack bags do tumbling now? and haircuts, then we'll do this after. Okay, tumbling and haircuts right now. Crew is ready, waiting on Brax. Rag guy's gonna come with me. We're gonna have to best buy, get a few last minute travel necessities for the vlog. Pick those up as the kids are at tumbling and then we'll take the kids from tumbling to haircuts. I think after that, but yeah, come home and do the snack bags. I think after that, we're gonna be ready, guys. We're gonna be ready to go leave out of town. Ooh. It's gonna be epic. We have successfully got tumbling taken care of. These yeah. boys finished up tumbling, did fantastic there. Then we all got our haircuts. Every single one of us, all for us. Now, right guy, it might not look like he got his haircut. That's because he's been wanting to get a haircut that is like a light trim on the sides and keep the length on top. My haircut, that's not a haircut. But basically, mom's always been there and so he's not been able to do that. Well, guess what? Dad was in charge this time and mom actually said it was fine. Brex, you open up here so we can see your haircut. You got your haircut looking good and fresh. Yes. Crew got his done. Guys, these are Disneyland haircuts. These are the haircuts that'll be whipping through the air on Incredicoaster, <laughs> running it hard on Radiator yeah. Racers. It's going down. I got my haircut because you know you can't wear hats. Well, you can, but like on the rides, it could fly off. So I just well, said, got a solid like point two five inches. I was like, just buzz it. Oh my gosh, look at that hair. That is lush, <laughs> thick. Oh, what we're doing right now by chilling in the car, probably wondering, we are right by where Hazy does dance and she happens to be getting out 10 minutes after we finish up haircuts. We're just chilling here, waiting for Hazy to pick her up, take her home from dance, and then we gotta pack our remainder of our carry-ons, which includes snacks, carry technology, power packs, anything you're gonna need, entertain, and eat on that long, long hour and a half flight. <laughs> this is all I'll need. That's yeah, got one too. Hey, we did stop off at Best Buy today while the kids were at Tumbling and we picked up a charging cable for the new MacBook because we need that for traveling and then a new battery for the GoPro 360 because ours had gone bad. We've been using it 
it so much. So we'll get you some 360 yeah. action of those rides and some of the fun there at Disneyland. And also this new fireworks spectacular, I thought it'd be kind of fun in addition to whatever we shoot on the vlog yeah. camera, to have the 360 camera rolling. We can see that in full 360, maybe even upload it in VR, like in full oh, 360, that'd yes, be kind of sick. So cool. And you guys could be like experiencing it the way we did yes. in VR, that'd be kind of cool. So anyways, that's all coming up for you guys. But right now, just chilling, hanging out, waiting to go get hazy. Yeah. Yep. This is one time that the pantry door needs to be open because it's all aboard the snack train, guys. Mama has got all the snack drawers open for you and a Ziploc baggie. Will everyone please enter the pantry, grab a Ziploc baggie, and fill those snacks. Now, guys, don't go too crazy because honestly, the flight is so short. Yes. Take as many as you'd like. You can also keep them in the hotel room. Hotel. Yes, Takis, heck yes. Here are our selections today. We have Rice Krispie Treats, Apple Sauces, Fruit Snacks, Cheez-Its, Goldfish, Reese's. These look pretty fun. What are these? Reese's peanut butter granola bars or something like that? We've got high chews, Starburst. I love these. Sweet and salty I don't bars. I remember the bag. Okay, so you grab one of those. These are Mom so I love good. these fig bars for sure. I love them. Fruit leathers, Takis. Takis! Oh, you guys love those. Now, if you want to, you can do those Takis as well. Fudge cookies. Don't fudge get too many of those. I'll just be quiet. Get out of your guys' way. Load them up. I got this, and I got fruit snacks, and I got an okay, apple sauce, I got Takis, and I got these little chips, and I got Cheez-Its. Kids are tying up the last loose ends on their carry-ons, packing up the electronics, the fun, the neck pillows. Not that long of a flight. <laughs> Did we get those in Turks when we had to fall asleep on the floor of the airport yeah. in Atlanta? I do remember yes. that. So many fun traveling memories, you guys, but this is gonna be the first one we've made from leaving this home. First oh, one of 2023. Tomorrow morning, we are going to be getting up at, mom's saying 4 a.m., I'm pushing for 4.30 so we can get a little bit more sleep. 4.15 in the middle. Out the door by 5.15 on our flight, headed over to California, Disneyland, right Ooh. into the park, and you guys, we are shutting the park down, going in after oh hours, and then that that's only the first day. The next day is full of more epicness. So, so you guys, it's going to be one of those where we run it till the wheels fall off. Most definitely. Celebrating 100 years of wonder at Disneyland. It's so going to be excited. magical. It's going to be epic. You guys are coming along with us. We love you guys so much. We'll see you all tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Bye. Bye. Oh my gosh, look at that hair. That is a lot <laughs> thick. Oh. This and I got fruit snacks and I got an apple sauce. I got takis and I got these little chips and I got cheeses.